Good morning, traders. Well, we've got another big week ahead. A US market snapped a, a multi-week losing streak last week with the S&P 500 having the best week in a month of the Dow at four down weeks before this. So um, big move up in the markets last week. Now, there's no rest for traders this week with some real tests to see if this rally will continue. Now, probably the first one coming along is Jerome Powell's testimony in front of the biannual, biannual congressional testimony. Um, now, last time he spoke was a while ago, and he spoke about disinflation, which saw the markets rally the hope that the Fed would take their foot off the accelerator a little bit. So there'll be a, traders will be looking for clues as to the Fed's next move in that meeting. Um, out of the US as well on Fridays, always the exciting non-farm payrolls. Now, last figure was a real blockbuster, 517,000 new jobs created. Was it a fluke? We'll find out on Friday. So everyone will be watching this. The stronger the, the labor market in the US is, obviously the more reason the Fed has to keep hiking rates. So both of those are, are critical this week on the direction of risk assets, equities, um, for, Forex as well. I mean, we had a very choppy week last week with the US dollar mainly finishing down. Um, that saw the Aussie dollar get back above 67, saw the euro get back to a 106 handle. Also helped along the gold price and oil as the US dollar went down. So that will also be on the line with uh, these US figures coming out this week. So definitely ones to watch. Um, the central bank news this week, the other big one I'll be looking at is the RBA on Tuesday. Now, there's a 75% chance, according to the bond market, that they're going to hike again 25 basis points. Um, being that it's not 100% priced in, whatever happens, you'll probably see some moves in the Aussie dollar. More risk to the downside if they hold, which is pretty unlikely. These bond traders are, are pretty smart and they rarely get it wrong. So more than likely, we're going to see that 25 basis point hike. Should see a small rally in the Aussie dollar on the back of that. But we'll also be looking for is the statement out of the RBA after that announcement. Um, the hike itself won't be the surprise. It'll be the statement whether it's seen as hawkish or dovish to see whether the Aussie dollar actually follows through uh, with any rally it has on that figure. All right, that's it for me for now. Um, keep an eye on my Twitter feed. I will update as the week goes on with anything I see of interest. <laughs>